Data acquisition software and data analysis. Application software lies at the core of modern data acquisition, DAC, systems. It facilitates the interaction between the computer and the user for acquiring, analyzing, and presenting measurement data. It is either a pre-built application with predefined functionality or a programming environment for building applications with custom functionality. Custom applications are often used to automate multiple functions of a DAC device, perform signal processing algorithms, and display custom user interfaces. Let's look at some measurement and analysis techniques. Frequency. Measuring the frequency of an analog signal is similar to measuring the rate of a digital signal. However, you cannot directly measure the frequency of an analog signal. Software analysis of the signal is required to, ex to extract the frequency information. The analysis is usually done by an algorithm called a fast Fourier transform, also called an FFT. An FFT converts a signal in the time domain to a signal in the frequency domain. Using an FFT function, you can output the magnitude of a signal at different frequency points. Level. Measuring the level of an analog signal is similar to measuring the state of a digital signal. The only difference is that an analog signal can be at any voltage state, whereas a digital signal can be at one of two states, either on or off. Peak detection is one of the most important time domain functions performed in signal monitoring. It is the process of finding the locations and amplitudes of local maxima and minima in a signal that satisfies certain properties. Statistics. Statistics help to understand complex and often large amounts of data by simplifying the data into comprehensible tables, numbers, or graphs. Examples include a student's GPA, a quarterback's passing rate, or the president's approval rating. Common statistical calculations include histograms, mean, mode, and standard deviation. Data visualization. When data needs to be presented, it is often done by means of visual representations. In a software and analysis application, it is useless to process data if it can't be communicated back to the user in some way. Typical visualization techniques include using a graph to display a group of data at once, a chart to display the newest data point acquired added to the display of the previous data points, or a table to clearly present processed data. Also, in some applications, it is useful or required to save the data to be visualized at a later point.